Okay, here's the means of identifying the coils in your trap if you don't have any color markings. Uh, if you look at the coils, uh, there's going to be one one coil with uh, more turns than the other for each set. So for the director, uh, the outer uh, coil has 23 turns, the inner coil has 14. For the radiator, the middle element, 24 turns for the outer coil, 14 for the inner. And the reflector has 25 turns for the outer coil and 15 for the inner. So uh, there's, the, uh, there's the color coding that uh, Mosley uses if you want to mark yours by color. Uh, director is black, radiator is blue, reflector is brown. So here you see a typical pair, an inner and an outer coil uh, from the inside of one trap and you can see that uh, uh, the inner uh, coil always has uh, fewer turns than the outer and by counting those number of turns you can determine whether the coil pair is for the reflector, director, or radiator. Another thing I learned from the Mosley manual is that this coil form plastic is polystyrene. So uh, if you're going to glue it, find a glue that is compatible with polystyrene. I'm pretty sure that's airplane cement. Um, but a, a check of the literature will probably tell you whether uh, uh, those are solvent glues. If you don't want to use a solvent glue, uh, two common strong glues are Gorilla Glue, which is a polyurethane one-part glue, and epoxy two-part glue. And you can find out whether those will adhere to polystyrene or not by looking them up.